What's up everyone and welcome to our junior club. Today we're drawing one of my favorite characters. This is me from the Muppets. Let's get started on the top of our page and draw two circles for the eyes. So we start with the one on the left, starting from the very top. Just gonna bring this all the way down towards the bottom of the eye and then back up towards the top. Now we wanna have the right eye touching the inside. So starting in the middle, go all the way around, up to the top and then back down. Let's add two small circles in the center of each eye to the pupil. And I'll fill those in black. Now with the eyes in place, we're going to tuck the nose in underneath. Let's start on the bottom left side. We're going to draw an oval. We're going to bend this out around the bottom and then back up underneath the right eye. Now let's draw on the side of the head. Underneath the left eye, draw a straight line coming all the way down towards the base of the neck. And then we'll do the same thing over on the right, coming down towards the same height. Let's pull this down and in towards the center, to the top edge of the collar. And now we'll go back and draw the mouth. Let's start on the left side of the nose, curve the mouth going out and then down. We're going to line up the top over on the right. Going out and then down towards the same height. Now let's connect the ends with a curve. Going up towards the nose and then back down. Now let's close off the top of the head. We're going to line up with the left side on top of the left eye. Curve this up and then back down. And now we're going to give him that bushy hair. Let's start on the left side of the head. Curve this out and then up. Go to the right, curve out, and up. Now you want to close off the top of the head with a series of points. Let's start back on the left, come down, and back up. Now we're going to go up a little bit higher in the middle. So repeating this pattern, going all the way up towards the top in the middle, and it'll bring that back down along the right side. I'm also going to add a little bit of texture along the bottom. Let's start right in the middle with a short line going up on the left side. Let's curve this out and up. Step over and draw a shorter one. We'll add one more over on the right. Now we're going to move down and draw on the side of the collar. From the bottom corners of the head, angle down and out. Pull that down and in. Leave a gap in the center. And we'll pull this up and in towards that center point on the bottom of the head. Now before we can finish off the body, let's draw the hands along the side. We start over on the left side with a straight line going across the top edge of the cuff. And we take that same line over on the right. So going across. From the inside, draw a straight line coming down towards the elbows. And we'll draw that same length line going out towards the side of the arm. And we'll close off the side of the arm with a straight line, just connecting the top and the bottom. Let's add the edge of the sleeve. Stepping down, draw another line across the top. Now you want to curl the fingers around the top. Let's start from the top corner of the arm. Start by curling out, bending that in, let's round up the finger, and then bend that back out. Let's take that and flip it over on the right. Going out, and then back in, round up the finger, and go back out. Let's place two more fingers along the top on either side. Starting from the left, I'm just going to draw it over, going around, and just tuck that in behind, and we'll do that one more time. And we'll do the same thing on the right. Start from the top, go all the way around, and then back out. And we'll do that one more time. Now we want to point the thumbs coming in. So let's start from the inside of the sleeve, curve around, and then down. Let's close off the inside of the hand, starting from the bottom of the finger, curve down and in behind the thumb. Let's go back and close off the side of the body. 
I'm going to continue this line down and out and behind the fingers. Now let's draw the inside of the jacket, starting from the bottom of the collar, angle down and in. And same thing on the right. Let's go to the inside of the collar, draw two short lines coming down towards the bottom of the tie. Close this off with a straight line. And then from the bottom corners of the knot, angle down and out. Now we're going to go underneath each arm, draw two straight lines coming down towards the bottom of the coat, connect the bottom with a straight line. And then from the bottom of the collar, draw a straight line coming all the way down towards the bottom. And then we'll add two buttons on the right side, one circle on the top and one on the bottom. Now I tuck the feet in underneath the coat, leaving a gap in the center, go to the left side, a straight line coming down towards the heel, the same thing on the right, and then we'll round out the bottom of the feet, starting on the left side, curve the foot coming down and then up. Let's go back over towards the left side, we're going to draw a half circle on the top of the foot, going up, pull that all the way down towards the bottom. And then from the inside of the shoe, curve this down and up. Now from the bottom corners of the coat, we'll step in, draw two straight lines coming down to the top of the feet. And that's pretty much it. There's me from the Muppets. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see you again soon.